Today we're taking a look at the Samsung Cordless Vacuum. This is a very nice vacuum with a base that has some cool features here. Not only does it charge your vacuum, but it can also empty the cartridge into a larger bag that is inside there. So very nice. I like the colors that come with it. Blends very nice in our house, even though we have it sitting kind of in the corner here. It's not ugly. I could hide the cables a little bit better with this. We're going to be looking at the pros and cons of this, give you a quick walkthrough of all the features, things you need to know about it, and more. First though, if you're new here, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, let YouTube know you enjoy what we do here. So YouTube recommends our videos to more people, helping us grow, helping us support our families, hopefully helping you decide if this is right for you. So with that said, let's start off with a few things. Let's just talk about the stand and then we're gonna take the vacuum off and give you a quick look at it. Now with this, you can pop this off in here and then in here you have the bag. It does come with a couple bags. I am kind of surprised at how long the bags last for. They're really nice there. Very easy to take that on and off. The vacuum comes in and out and you can just press this button right here. And now it's emptying. And it'll keep going until you stop it. Very easy. Now, one thing about this is when you take it out now and notice that door's open, make sure you close that door before you uh, use it or everything you're going to vacuum is just going to come out with it. Um, it also, when you plug it in, it gives you, you saw real quick there how much power is left with it. Um, now, let's take this vacuum out. I'm going to pause the video here and show you the actual vacuum. We'll talk about the vacuum. Hey, real quick, before I forget again, if you want to find this on Amazon, we'll put a link to this in the show notes and in the first pinned comment so you can find all the current pricing. Pricing changes so rapidly. I hate to give you a price and have it be wrong. If I happen to not answer any questions you have during this, leave me a comment. Let me know. But for the actual specs, check out the Amazon listing. I'm going to give you everything I know have learned about this as an average everyday user of it. So this is the actual Samsung vacuum. Very simple. It does have an extendable rod here. And you can pop off this top, which I'll show you in a little bit. But it's very simple to use. I really do like how flexible it is. You can easily use this however you want. Slip underneath furniture very easily with this. The um, adjustability on this is excellent with it. Now, it does have a removable battery, so you can exchange it here. It does also rapid charge. Um, let's take a look at the power settings here before I get into other parts of this. So you got, it always starts on that and then jet. We'll let it go for a second get, so you can see. So about eight minutes remaining on that. Let's see with max. 14. 24. So not as long of a battery life as other models. Not even as long as other Samsung models. Uh, but really, I find the standard version, the 24 minute when you first turn it on, is very comparable to most standard vacuums on the market today. I think that that Max is super powerful, which is nice if you have some stuff stuck in your carpet, but it's honestly kind of overkill for just everyday vacuuming. Now, one thing about this is the vacuum head here is not that big. Now, we have a central vacuum in this house that I absolutely love the central vacuuming. But if I'm just want to vacuum around the table or pick up a little spill of the kids, it's kind of annoying. I don't really want to do that for all of this. So this allows me to easily get everything I want without having to worry about it, which is nice. Let me take this apart and show you everything with it and give you my final thoughts with it. So final thoughts with this real quick. It's a nice vacuum. Again, like I said earlier, the head of it is kind of small. It's not something I'm gonna want to vacuum my entire house with all the time if I have a lot of carpet, but this is the perfect little vacuum for vacuuming either small apartments, small homes, maybe you have a lot of tile, a lot of wood in your home and you just have a little bit of carpet, you wanna use this. Or you're like me, you have two kids that make messes and you just want something you can quickly grab to pick up the goldfish off the counter or around the table or something. Uh, so very nice with that. Overall, excellent vacuum. Yeah, the battery life isn't the greatest. It did come with two uh, batteries with this. So you can swap the batteries real quick and then external stand with the options to charge that battery. Honestly, I find for what we use this for, to vacuum a room, to vacuum around the table, the battery life has never been a problem. One note with this, it is top heavy, so it doesn't freestand, but it does have grips meant to just kind of lean against the wall like this. You're not gonna be able to just stand it up and have it run um, without you holding it. So overall, two thumbs up. I will put a link to this on Amazon down in the show notes and in the first pinned comment if you wanna find it there. If you have any questions, leave me a comment, let me know. I'll love to hear from you.